The oceans thrived, dominated by fish, evolving incredible adaptations like jaws and fins. Armored giants like Dunkleostis became apex predators, ruling the ancient seas with brute force. But some fish, with their unique lobed fins, felt the irresistible pull of a new frontier, land. Early amphibians found a new world, a carboniferous swamp rich with unexplored opportunities. The land teemed with giant insects, a vivid alien ecosystem waiting for new masters. Yet, these early land dwellers remained tied to water, their eggs vulnerable, dependent. The land presented challenges, droughts, harsh sun, and the constant need for hydration. Evolution responded. The amniotic egg, a portable pond, freed life from the water's edge. This simple, ingenious egg allowed reptiles to truly conquer the arid, challenging landscapes. The Permian era saw giant sail-backed reptiles dominate, perfectly adapted to a drier world. While giants roamed, Smaller, nimbler reptiles, the diapsids, quietly refined their form. Then, catastrophe struck. The Permian-Triassic extinction, wiping out 90% of all life. Only the most resilient survived, clinging to existence in a scarred and devastated world. But life finds a way. Over millions of years, the planet slowly began to heal itself. Among the survivors, a new lineage emerged, the Archosaurs, ancestors of future giants. These agile, bipedal creatures possessed a spark of the future, a new way of moving. The stage was set. The world was recovering, ready for a new chapter, a new dominant force. The Permian's ashes gave birth to the Triassic's pioneers, forking a path to dominance. The age of reptiles was over. The age of dinosaurs was about to begin.